visualizing solid shapes. Next week is Rahul's birthday in India. For that, Rahul wants to invite his pen pal John, who lives in Paris, in France. Rahul wrote to John, trying to explain where he has to come for the birthday party. This is how he did it. In the world, India is located here. Maharashtra state is located on the western side of India. In Maharashtra, Mumbai city is located here, on the coast. And this is South Mumbai, where I stay. Rakesh is Rahul's younger brother. He's drawing a map on the board to explain to his friend where he stays. Usually, maps are used to locate a particular place, river, mountain, etc. Map is different from a picture. This map is drawn by Rakesh. In this map, the route from his house to his uncle's house is shown. How far is his house from his uncle's house? From this map, it is very difficult to find which place is near to his house. We do not know the distance between the circles. So there is a lack of information. And hence, we cannot answer the questions above. Now look at this map. This map is drawn by Rahul. Rahul uses different symbols for different landmarks. Longer line segments have been drawn for longer distances and shorter line segments have been drawn for shorter distances. Thus, this map has been drawn to the various symbols and the distances represented on the map makes it easier to read the map. Maps not only help us understand locations, but also help us to see how big or small places are in comparison to other places. Observe that on this map, the distance is denoted by 1 cm or 1 mm. These distances show on the map are proportional to the actual distances on the ground. Maps do this with the help of a special idea called the scale. This is the picture of a car. In the picture, the car is 3 cm long. 1 cm in the picture is the same as 1 meter of the real car. This is the scale of the drawing. The scale is 1 cm is equal to 1 meter. So the length of the car in reality is 3 meters, but on the map it is scaled and represented as 3 cm. Similarly, for the bus, the scale is 1 cm is equal to 1 meter. Therefore, the length of the bus is 7 meters. For a big truck, we cannot draw the real truck length on the map. We therefore consider an easier scale. The scale is 1 cm is equal to 2 meters. The length of the real truck will be 6 into 2 meters. This means that if one draws a map, he or she has to decide that 1 cm of space on that map shows a certain fixed distance of say 1 meter or 10 meters in reality. Thus, scales can vary from map to map, but not within a map. Let us summarize what we have learned. A map depicts the location of a particular object or place in relation to another object or place. Symbols are used to depict the different objects or places. Maps use a scale which is fixed for a particular map. It reduces their real distances proportionately to distances on the paper.